in India and we went to this ladies thing and we really felt that we were going to wash like to wash their feet and the, the lady that was in charge was like that might be kind of weird are you sure and we prayed about it and we like really felt that we should so we did and the late one of the ladies I was washing her feet and she just like started crying and like she was really touched and she said that she like it felt like God was like or Jesus was like washing her feet like just from that story and like it was really cool. So the Burmese camp in Malaysia when we had like the girls separate with the guys like the guys were in a group and the girls were in a group and at the end like we had the girls like ask God what he thought of them like write on a piece of paper and then there's this little girl sitting next to me and she like didn't really understand what to do and she just didn't like I don't know, she was kind of young and she was just kind of like, I don't know what to do. And she didn't get anything from God, so like I prayed, like, I prayed about her kind of and asked God for words for her and I wrote them down and gave it to her and she was just like really touched by that. And I thought it was really cool and yeah, it made me feel good, like being able to share God's love like and what he thought about her with her. One of my favorite times was when we were in India and we were with Richard and Vicky at their youth thing and after we had been done we were just like mingling with the people and I was off getting a drink or something and then this guy brings this girl over to me and he's just like, I need you to pray for her. Um, like something about her family doesn't love her and whatever. So I'm like, okay, I don't really know how to pray for this, but whatever. So I just put my hand on her and started praying and um, didn't really know what I prayed for. But then she's just like, oh, thank you so much. And then I was like, oh, you're welcome. And then all of a sudden she just like wraps her arms around me and starts bawling her eyes out. I was like, okay. Done. So I just like, kept on praying for her, and it was really cool. Yeah, my favorite thing that God has done through me on this outreach is still naming the baby. Um, <laughs> like, I can't get over that. Um, yeah, I had the idea, like, when we prayed in Perth, what we were going to see happen. I had this idea of, like, naming a baby, and I kind of thought that, that would be further down the line, or that was just, like, something that came from me rather than God. It was good. Uh...